What's up, everybody? Welcome back. I know it's been a little while. Um, let's see. I've been a little busy with some stuff. I'm, I finally get to go out and do a toy hunt for the Godzilla X Kong, the new Empire figures. I am right now outside Walmart, so let's go on inside and see what we can find. All right, so, so far as I can see, I don't see none of the figures are out yet, so I am going to try and find someone to ask them. So I will bring y'all back if we do find them or when I get back to the car, because I got to go pick up a few things while I'm in here. So I will see y'all in a few minutes. All right, um, I did not get no footage of like with the lady helping me. Because um, they just, just didn't want to be filmed. And I mostly had the camera facing me. So, I mean, everybody doesn't want to be on camera. That's fine. But um, they did not have them on the shelves. Because they are getting ready to um, move some stuff around, they said. But, but, the lady was actually nice enough to go back and see. to this show that they had them in the back. She was nice enough. She went back there, checked, and what she had or what they could get their hands to were the double pack. Now, Grant, I do not have them in the car with me. If I did, I would show. They're in the trunk because there was some stuff also in with the bag, so I just grabbed all the bags without thinking. So, they're in the trunk. I got both double packs. And probably I won't get the... The single packs because I got them, but I am so going to, I'm going to go somewhere else. I'm going to try a different Walmart. And if not, there is a Target right there beside there. So I will hit that store too on the way out. So I will hopefully see y'all there. If not, I will definitely see y'all back at the house. So, I will see y'all in a minute. Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Oh, my goodness. It's been a few, a few days have passed since the beginning of this video. And I'm going to tell y'all what happened. Time I got home from going out shopping and everything, it, it was just, um, it was messed up because of what ended up happening. Because of what happened in the store, it some stuff got said, and find out I couldn't record anything because of the um, the phone that I use to record. I don't have a camera. I don't know why I keep saying I have a camera because I use an old phone to do my recordings. Because like right now, you see everything looks good. Instead of this, I do I did do my um, usual shave as like I normally do every year at the beginning of the year at midnight. It goes right off, start the new year fresh, but I'm getting off topic. So what happened was I thought the, the device was being recharging on the drive because from where I was at to where I was going was about an hour, hour and a half drive because of some traffic. There was some road work going on and... I didn't know that the cord wasn't all the way pull, pushed in or the wire was like weak. Something went wrong, so the, the thing was not charged. I walked in the store. Grad, I forgot to even try to see if it was going to work. I'm walking around think, and t turned it on right when I got to an aisle by myself. To, uh, one time I had a bad experience, walked in, had some people walking in with me. So I went until I get like an aisle by myself. I turn on, cut whatever I need to and everything. But have y'all also seen the new things about the SH Monster Arts? We'll talk about that in a minute. I'm going to show y'all what I ended up getting. Like I said, I got these at Walmart. And that is the, the double pack. Um, Godzilla and Shimo, and the double pack with Kong, with Beast Glove, and Scar King. And I think that is the new heave we are getting. Now, Grant, I did not pick up the other ones because I figured 
I'm gonna end up cl um, getting these. Th I'm gonna do my, my what I do, and that is um, repainting them. So I don't see no need me getting the other ones unless I need to, you know. And I mean, I would say this: if you are on a budget, go with these because this a lot cheaper. You get both of them a lot cheaper than you get them separate. $9.99 for one. So that's um, because of tax and stuff. That's um, $25 to um, $26 or close to that range. This right here, tax and everything, $18. And you also get the bonus with the, um, the cardboard pieces. And guess what? If you don't know what to do with them, do like I did right here. If my finger, if I can find it, right there is the buildings that I have behind mine. And also right here you have Santa Kong just sitting there. I haven't fixed him yet, but we'll talk about that another day. But, yeah, I highly recommend you do that. If you are on a budget, if you want to just go out and get them without having, like, the neat, like, different colors. Like how she moves on um, charging up or just having the ice and stuff. That's fine. You do you. I, w I do not judge. You do what you want to do. What makes you happy makes me happy. But also, why well, I said I went to Target, right? And I said they had them. But there was a bonus in this section. I was not expecting to get this whatsoever. I could not find this nowhere. And I saw this and I was like kind of hesitant on getting it. And the person even said, that don't belong there. That don't look like the new ones. Why is that here? It was the only one the store has. And the guy said, well, I'll cut you a deal. If you get one of them, I'll get this one. I'll let you get this one half off. So, I mean, half off. You can't beat that. You know? So, I got that. So, the guy that, um, helped me out on that. And I got um, Suko. And Doug. Everywhere else said they do not have these. These will not hit the shelves until March. Is what I got told. Guess what? It ain't March. And I got this. So I saw this. And this was the only one Target had. So you guys. Y'all gotta imagine how excited I was to get this. And I done. But um, also, I'm going to say why it took me so long a couple days later to do those videos. Because we had a very bad storm the day after I went out and got these. A very bad storm that um, I lost power for a little while. And I was still like doing the editing and kind of going on and off with the um, War Dog video. But other than that... I got it, but um, since we can't do a size comparison with this Kong, guess what? I'm going. I'm just going to show this off. I'm going to get these bags out of my way. That um, because if y'all notice this, what's what is up with this Kong right here? What makes this one different than the other one? Is it that he has a bigger beard, a thicker beard, and he's um. Gray, got more gray going on. I'm going to show y'all this, and I know a lot of y'all, but the ones that are new here that have not seen this, guess what? There's a, I have a Kong. Bigger beard and dark fur with gray. I wonder where they might get that from. And if you want to know which video this is on, this is on Future or Old Kong. It was supposed to be in the original, but because when the movie came out, I gave him too much of a beard. And I made him too, like, made him look a little too old. But yeah. Where y'all get that idea from? Where did you get it from? I'm just playing. I don't know if that's true or not. I have no idea. I just thought that was funny. Is when I got it, got the box here, and I started thinking about it, I was like, wait a minute, didn't I make one like that? There it is. 
here it is right here. I'll move it a little bit closer for y'all to see. The only thing I'm missing was the extra new scars that Godzilla gave Kong. But when I made this, was way before the movie came out. So I didn't know about the scarring or anything. Or if I did, I would have probably threw it in there. But I already painted it. I didn't want to mess it up whatsoever. So, but if you're wondering, also, I did not get the, um, well, let me see. What does this say? This one right here, I did not get the heat ray. Is that what it says? Heat ray? Yeah. The heat ray version. I mean, if you want to go on and get it, go ahead. I won't stop you. But guess what? There we go right there. And it's already repainted for the original look and everything. And if I want to grab something different, guess what? I just got to reach over here. Uh, just try not to knock nothing over. But boom, there we go. Comes with the beam. And he's already got... The the light up, oh my goodness, did y'all, did no, I didn't even think about this. We could put this guy with this pack because he's already showing that orange and everything. Yeah, we could do that. There we go. It works. It all worked out at the end. Put this back over here behind, beside Kong. That's also like that. So we could act, we don't even got to do nothing. Look, look at this. If I can reach it because it was further in the back of the corner. Look, look at that. He's got the orange going on for some reason. It's just not as bright. But guess what? I mean, the only difference is the beard's not as um as long or anything. But, Grant, when you look at this picture, I just noticed this. You don't even see the scars or anything. All you see is that red um, spot on his chest. Red and yellow on the outside. But yeah, you can definitely see the scratches. I just noticed this right here. If you see the um, Kong right here, you can see all the scratches that Godzilla gave him. And you can see a little... Yeah, you can still see the main scar going across his chest. But no, I think... This works and everything. I mean, everything looks like it still does everything like the others. All it is just got that neat, or somewhat neat. I don't know. I showed somebody this, or told them about it in the store, and they couldn't believe me. It's like, do you have these ones right here, and they just splattered paint on there? Kong looks okay with the orange. You could say like that's um, he's burning up or something. He's his energy is building up because of the glove. Scar King is just shadowed because of the way they decided to do it for the light and for the um, the things right here. See Kong's facing it. That means he's facing away from the lava, so that's why his side's like that. So would that mean his back be all lit up like Kong's chest? I can't wait to open this up and find that out because that's kind of got my attention. But I'm going to put this back over here. Hopefully I don't knock nobody over. Because I have one figure over here that Will not stand by itself. He has to have a stand. I'll show y'all right quick. If you can see, right there is my um, Monster X figure. And he will not stand by himself no matter what pose I put him in. Will not stand whatsoever. At least the, my um, Kador figure up here, if it will show it, does stand up without the mill stand. I do have the wing stands, but um, I am hopefully... Gonna have um Haya's version coming soon. Whenever the they get them, to mail them out. Hopefully it'll be soon. But yeah, we got those. I'm glad that I did find this. I am actually really excited about this one for some reason. But um I started thinking about something. If um y'all get this or if you have this and have the mini figures, see if I can um uh, Grab them right quick. If you have this figure right here, this actually does work good with this so far as I could see with it in the box. We'll find more out when I review it. I don't, I don't know what fell. I'm going to shove that back there. But um, yeah, um, 
I think that's going to do it. Video here. We got the two double packs. Two double packs. We got King Ghidorah. And we got Suko and Doug. Titanus Doug. Yes. And um, I hope to see everybody next time.